Section 95, verse 12. If you keep not my commandments, the love of the Father shall not continue with you. Therefore you shall walk in darkness. Now I've heard people take this the other way and say, see that says if you don't keep the commandments, God doesn't love you. No, that's not what it's saying. It's saying you won't feel and enjoy the love of God as you would if you kept the commandments. Follow? Yeah. Every, every uh, law that He has given to us or every commandment that He's given to us, I always thought, I simply said, if I do what the law tells me to do, I get the I blessing. Get blessed. Yeah. That's conditional to me. That's correct. Not unconditional. That's right. So we could say God loves us always, but He can't always do for us some things He would like to do unless we keep the commandments. Right? right? Now, I, I say all that because here's another Book of Mormon passage that becomes very interesting. Let's go to 1 Nephi 17. We'll have someone read this for us. 17. Look at verse 35. Who's got it? Mm -hmm. Read it for us. Behold, the Lord esteemeth all flesh in one. He that is righteous is favored of God. Let's just pause there. That's all we need to do. Favored of God. Now, your good sense would tell you what. What that doesn't mean is what. He that is righteous is favored of God. What are you prone to think that means? I like my righteous people more. Now, you know that's not true because he loves all of his children. But what is it saying? Favored here means blessed. I've been favored of God. I've been blessed of God. Um, I mean, how does the very Book of Mormon start? I, Nephi, having been born of goodly parents, therefore I was taught, having been highly favored of the Lord. I don't think Nephi's saying, he's loved me more than the others for a long time. I think he's saying, having been greatly blessed. Greatly blessed. And so, the Lord esteemeth all flesh in one. He loves everybody. He that is righteous is favored of God, but only the righteous are the ones that can enjoy the blessings of God, meaning the blessings that come from obedience. Okay? 